Right, corner stands. I've been told to do this quite a lot. My comment section's been plagued by this. So now we're doing it. Right, so, empty place. What do you do? Loads of ways to do this. One way I like to do it is you grab the ring gallery, excuse my controller drift. Excuse my controller drift. Get the biggest one. Size it down. Then try and get it to line up with not the middle of here. No. Make it line up with this tile. Why? Because instead of doing this as a circle trick, because that won't work, we're going to do this. Well, not really a circle trick, it's just easier. Well, it also depends on how much you want the curve. This just up to personal preference. But yeah, as I was saying, put the thing down. Okay. Now we have our guideline. We're gonna copy this and try and get this. This is a stair piece that you can use for the agency. Or try and get this to line up with around this. Once you've done that, you have all this space. What do you do with all this space, you might ask? Well, grab this. This might be really hard for me to show. Okay, okay, okay. You just... You can either freehand, like... If I can even do it. Which usually gives you more control over it. Like this. And this. This is just a rough version. So I, yeah, you can freehand. Or you can... Make a circle out of it. One, two, three, four. Give it a second, let me just try and stop myself from moving for literally just a second. Yeah, or the easier way fix this. But then the problem, which you, you can fix pretty easily. Now this is underground. Just raise this up. Perfect. I'll clean all the things up. And you have a stand. Wait, no. Clean this up. Now you have a stand. So it's either the manual way of doing it. It gives you more control of the shape. Or just a circle trick, which is way easier. Give you basically just a circle to work with. As for entrances, that would involve making a hole here to place your piece. Like what I did in my stadium. But yeah, that's basically how you make a corner stand.